What's going on guys? Today we got our hands on the House Rules Odell Beckham Jr. First things first, shout out to my man Zeke for getting this card for us to record the video with. Would have came out a few days earlier, but um yeah, some you know, I you know, moved, you know, it would have came out earlier, but at least we are here today dropping the video. And uh, yeah, if you are part of the 67% of people who watch the videos and are not subscribed, let's change that right now. Head down there, hit the subscribe button, turn on those notifications. Without further ado, here is Odell Beckham Jr., okay? 99 speed, 99, <laughs> really short route running, uh, deep route running, 90, 97 mid route running. Spec catch, of course, is going to be 99 on Odell Beckham Jr. 5'11", people might be a little bit afraid of that, but I think it's actually a good thing as, you know, zone KOs in this game are the meta, and being able to counter those with smaller receivers is actually very it's very important of course if heading down here after the catch of course gonna have the 99 cod 99 juke move um 99 release is also it's not the biggest thing but it does make a slight difference especially when people try to press you and then you also have the 99 catching traffic so really good stats on odell and the cool thing about this card is that he does get all previous third uh, or sorry all, all previous promo uh theme team chemistries as well as all 32 team chemistries and my man zeke right here he's got um, aka Cruz Legion of Boom on Odell. Obviously, he didn't play for that team, but he still gets it. And he also is rocking with like some kind of Tennessee team. I'm not really too sure what it is, but he is rocking with that. For the abilities, of course, he does get all the golden ticket pre-lits, which is obviously another pretty big deal right there. And then for the zero AP abilities, he's, he's gonna get the leapfrog zero, wide receiper apprentice for one, route tech zero, and then run off a leap for zero as well. So a really good zero AP setup on Odell Beckham Jr. Makes him really good after the catch. And you obviously put Yak Yakum up on top of that, or you can go max security. Whatever you want to do, angry run, short, whatever you want to do, Odell is able to do it uh, with the all 32 team chems and all of the past promo theme team chems. So a very good card and a card that really will fit on every single person's team. So without further ado, I said that like four times, let's get into the gameplay here with Odell. All right, here we go. We got game number one with Odell. We are in the Eagles playbook. And let's see what we can do here with Odell Beckham Jr. Obviously, just getting the ball in his hands is going to be the big thing. Uh, showing off the uh, after the catch we are gonna get man on the first play of the game here so uh, hopefully we don't get hopefully we don't fumble as that is a um quite a popular thing here in this game all right so it doesn't look like we are playing a guy who is familiar with wing slot so we're not gonna be able to really hit that as much as we probably would want to but again even just getting the ball into odell's hands and i'm glad he's also number 13 um that makes me happy to see him in the 13 step in the pocket he's gonna he's gonna go with odell we probably had the post Oh, no, he's going to be this guy in the slot. Okay, we, I just got to get a first down at the end of the day. So let's just try to get that. We should get... He's really dropped back far here. We should get the first down here with Luck. Fortunately, no... Um, oh, we eat a hit stake. Do we get the first down there? We, they do give us the first down. I, didn't, I wasn't sure if the ball got past there or not. But this guy's already doing a lot of... But let's see what he does here. Okay, and he's going to try to get back to it. He does not that time and no KO, thankfully. Odell Beckham. Oh! Odell Beckham broke so many tackles. I stopped playing i thought he went down if we get someone else we're gonna take it maybe i'll pump here go high ball over the top damn we throw a pick okay that's what happens we try to force okay into another game here let's hope we can get some better luck here with odell beckham but back to what i was saying about tyree kill i do think tyree a guy like tyree kill should be a part of your receiving core um and he's gonna be man here at zone we get oh we fumble on the first okay maybe that luck will not change here but I, but I do think a guy like tyree kill should be in your receiving core but if you compare tyree kill to these other receivers in the game it's tough to take him over some of these guys. It definitely is just one-on-one. -on -one. If you have, you know, a Calvin Johnson and a Vincent Jackson, I like having a Tyree kill with those guys. I um, mean, I think that's what, what people are, I mean, the wide receiver kills is so tough. I was trying to explain it. And we should we should go crazy here with Odell. We get, okay, we get the, probably the worst tackle animation we could have asked for. If we get anything else, we literally are, have a touchdown. All right, let's, let's look at playing man there. So let's try streak this. We got to pretty much max protect this just because of what he's doing what we want is his corner out to odell we're getting pressed so bad look at the look at the press right there okay odell's gonna shake one odell's gonna shake another we should break that no we don't break that tackle but did you see odell getting pressed right there i mean that that um i'm gonna decline it because i want the yards but that um that press was kind of going crazy against odell it was going crazy uh, pretty much yeah I, I feel like with the wide receivers right now there's so many good options in the game right now that so i'm not i'm not gonna throw a pick in the red zone again we're gonna go for a touchdown this time but so little separates a guy who's in S tier to a guy who's in C tier. You could use, if you watched that tier list yesterday, you can literally use any of those wide receivers right now. And that's what makes end game rankings quite difficult as what is going on up there. But um, yeah, because they're all so good. It's so, so, so little separates them. We should, we should get this pretty easy. Odell Beckham, 
you're gonna go ahead and get go ahead and get it right there and i feel like yeah if you're looking for a um you know if you have two tall receivers or two you know six foot three six foot four guys six foot five guys maybe and i think i'd rather have odell than a guy like tyree kill um yeah you can put them all together and you'd, you'd be okay they're obviously all very good but that's that's why Ty, i saw the most tyree kill comments for sure 100 percent. it wasn't even really close to be honest with you but i thought i would probably explain it because i don't even think i talked about tyree kill in the video because he was in a past tier list so i don't know but odell beckham moves great plays great you see the yak him up uh you see the uh, route tech which you know and his size is good enough he's able to avoid the, the ko's he does everything you kind of want him want him to do so let's try playing some defense here or actually is he already 180 games let's just get back on offense versus another team and i promise this is the last thing i'll say about uh tyree kill another thing is the x factor like the newer cards that just came out the theme team all-star cards their x factors are better than tyree kills as well so it, i i was surprised at how many comments i saw maybe because tyreek is like a fan favorite card maybe that's why i was quite surprised by it. we should have that open no ko i tried to go for the touchdown there but it's okay all right pretty much the same concept the same scheme we're gonna go ahead and throw this thing i have his own drops on this time i'm gonna i'm gonna highball this try to possession catch it and no uh, we shouldn't have probably done that and okay another thing about the wide receiver tier list i saw comments about was the max security from what i used the max security it was way more consistent than not having it i it was like a pretty much a it was a very good counter to me it was a very good counter to me and from what i used maybe i wasn't using it enough maybe you guys aren't possession catch i don't know the people who commented that but with my experience with the ability it is a hundred percent worth it especially like i don't know if it's better than yak em up as far as like after the catch would i rather use yak em up or max security that's up in the air because i like to run a lot of rpos and things like that and just you know a guy like odell you see what he's doing out here um i obviously and this is gonna be tough defense here oh we actually have that wow um but see max security we might go down and catch that i possession caught that but fortunately that's not gonna work and where i've noticed max security work the best easily is kind of when you're in one-on-one -on -one. if you have like multiple guys around you you know that's where the inconsistencies kind of come in and you might get the ko that you don't want but one-on-one -on -one, if you throw it max security you're gonna catch it i mean it has to be a ball that you can possession catch it can't just be a you know a willy-nilly throw that's just thrown out there you know what i mean there has to be it has to be a possession catch opportunity um so hopefully that cleared some up cleared some things up about yesterday's video hopefully it did um but as far as today goes we're also going to have some uh I'm not sure when I'm gonna drop this video, but I, I would assume we have golden tickets today, right? So reveals will be coming out. I'm actually recording this the same day as the wide receiver tier list, but dropping it on Tuesday. So yeah, Odell Beckham, you know, did his thing out there. 5'11. Yeah, I think he's a yeah, I had him top five on the tier list. I stand by that. Uh it's my first time actually using him, and he's lived up to the hype for sure. I, I you know, it's made me consider going for the 80 wins on my own account for sure. I mean, this card is who doesn't love Odell? How could you not love Odell? Always, always fun cards, always fun cards. Bang. Okay. All right. All right. Have a good rest of your day. And of course, thank you for watching today's video and I will see you boys in the next one.